what's up guys welcome back today we're going to be checking out an all new horror game here on the channel welcome to massacre at the mirage clearly this is just the demo version of the game the official game has not yet released but based on what we play here and what we experience then maybe this could be a game that we can do a full walkthrough too i've heard some pretty good things about it but i guess we'll have to play it and judge it for ourselves so sit back relax and let's do this in our traditional and charming movie theater the mirage we've got more than just popcorn and sticky floors to make you scream step into the shoes of various characters be it the overworked staff or unsuspecting movie buffs prepare for a night of horror you'll never forget <laughs> Halloween of 1988, just outside the Mirage. I can't believe I'm stuck working on Halloween night. What a total drag. Yeah, what a drag. Damn. Oh no, I feel <laughs> loves to do these old black and white midnight shows every October. What is she smoking? The f <laughs> At least I'm not working alone. I'm glad Ben will be here to keep me company. Well, I've, I've, at least we've got some voice acting, you know, some dialogue, narration. That's that's always nice. Well, I better head inside. The doors will be opening soon. Yeah, let's just head inside and get out of here. You know, WASD to move around. Left mouse button to interact. Make sure the parking lot's all good. Nobody here. Perfect. So far, so good. I love how this is taking place in the 80s. It gives you that, like, 90s flick, 80s flick vibe, you know? I like it so far. Let's see. Hey, Ben. You're working the box office tonight, I see. Yeah. Ooh. Who knows what kind of ghosts and ghouls are going to wander in tonight. <laughs> Right? Who wants to watch an old black and white movie on Halloween night anyway? I know I would rather be out partying right now. Bill loves these late night shows and he's the boss. So here we are. I just wish we weren't so short staffed. It can get kind of hectic sometimes. Speaking of which, Bill needs you to load and test the projector before we open for the night. I believe he's up in his office waiting for you. All right, I'm going to head inside then. All right. Sounds good. Go ahead and close the doors behind just in case. We are playing a horror game after all. That means trust absolutely nobody. So I think this is one of their games I've seen. Um, I'm not sure. Maybe even possibly all three of these. I'd have to kind of look into that, but... If so, I think that's pretty cool that they've included it in here. Anyway, I guess we should go speak to our boss. Maybe through here. Yep. What does it say? Employees only beyond this point. All right, here we go. I'm not too sure that I'm comfortable with how quiet things are right now. Loving the, the, the posters all across the... Uh, the Mirage, really sweet. Oh. Oh, there he is. Hey. You've got a black cat. Oh, shit. I'm, I'm screwed, aren't I? Whiskers. Hey, Phil. Ben told me you needed to see me. I wonder if those posters are done like with AI. That one kind of looks like it on the left. Good evening, Nico. Yes, I know I have you running the snack bar today, but I need your help with the film projector as well. Sure. What do you need me to do? I need you to grab the footage from Eric down in the basement and then load and test the film on the projector. Everything should be good with it. I just want to double check and make sure. Sounds simple enough. I'll go see Eric. One more thing. Before you go and see Eric, 
Can you please gather all of the trash from the trash bins and take it to the dumpster out back? Sure thing, boss. Awesome. Yeah. Thanks, Nico. So we've got an objective in our hands, and I think Q was to bring it up. So grab all the trash from around the theater. Okay, here we go. Oh, snap, I just realized. I've got legs. Yes. I actually like when games do that. It's a stupid little detail, but I, I don't know. I like it. Oh. Oh, here we go. So, six trash bins left. Okay, this ought to be simple enough, right? All right, going to the showroom. We've got two more here. And it's pretty damn dark. Now, I do have this fat light in my face, so... It kind of does give you like a massive glare on the screen and sometimes you guys will, you know, you guys will see like certain things in the dark that I probably won't. So just keep that in mind. All right, we've got another one there in the hallway. Now we're going into the women's restroom. We've got another one here. Nobody here. Bathroom for women is clear. Oop, got another one here at the very end of the hallway into the men's section. Thankfully, there's nobody here today. So this is totally legal. Close that up. All right, so we need how many? Take trash dumpsters out back. All right, so we got them all. Is that it? That was quick. Oh, what is it? What is this? Oh, shit. Hold on. Have we been here? Uh, Why is this so freaking tight? I don't like this. Hello? Oh, wait, we're in the... Oh. Okay, 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 okay. We have to go back. I hate how you have to go through this massive hallway to get there. Oh, here we go. Perfection. Excuse me, young lady. Can you spare some change? What the fuck, dude? I'm working here. Shit, man. Don't you know not to sneak up on people like that? Please, young lady. Help an old drunk get his <laughs> booze for Halloween. Uh, you have been told not to hang around back here. This is private property. Now get out of here. This might have been a bad idea to reject the poor homeless man for some change. Ah, forget you, you ugly old bitch. <laughs> Dang. I better tell Eric to double check the lock on the gate. I don't know how he keeps getting back here. Uh, all right, sir. Be safe out there. I'd probably put on some socks. It's kind of foggy out and scary. Eh. Whatever. Okay, so grab the film reel on Eric's desk. And that is where. Ooh. Okay, we're going down here. Oh, all right, this theater is a lot bigger than... Hey! Hey, Nika! Happy Halloween! Hey, Eric, how are things? You're looking pretty mellow right now. <laughs> yeah! Nothing's gonna harsh my vibe tonight. That's for sure! Let's just say I got my hands on some high quality brownies. <laughs> you can have one if you like. Uh -oh, Maybe God. after work. I don't think I can handle working the snack bar. No worries. Just let me know. Anyway, what brings you down to my corner of the world? Phil sent me to grab the footage for tonight so I can test it before we open the doors. Bill's always worried about the show. But yeah, it's right on the table. Thanks, Eric. Oh, by the way, I ran into that homeless man out back hanging around the dumpster again. Ah, bummer. I'll head out back and make sure the back gate is locked. All right, man, the music is loud down here. Okay, objective updated. Install the film reel on the projector upstairs and test the footage. 
So Eric's had some high quality brownies, he said. I wonder what that could be, huh? Okay. Let's go here. I'm just gonna call it right now. I don't think it's gonna be the last of that hobo that we've that we see throughout this playthrough. I'm just gonna throw that out there. Film projector. It requires a top feeder canister to work with film loaded into it. The canister should be on the table close by. Okay, we got this. Put the canister, and here we go. footage was actually kind of creepy that's what i'm saying nika i'm all done up here i should get down to the snack bar and prepare for the show all right so down to the snack bar we go which is where we normally typically work all right now we've got to be careful with this long hallway here i don't trust it i don't trust it one bit so i'm not going to be sprinting maybe just little dabs of sprints Maybe I'm a little bit paranoid. You guys know me in tight spaces. I don't do too hot in those spaces. All right. Homeless man is gone. Have they locked? Have they locked the door? They still haven't locked. Can I go outside? Oh, I didn't even think about that. Oh my God, he's right there. I'm so, I wish I had some spare change. See, if the game would let me, I'd probably spare some, but sorry. They still haven't really locked the theater. This is the stupidest thing they could do right now. Okay. That's the bath bathroom area. Let's go ahead into the showroom and see if there's... Okay, everything's good. Just kind of, you know, going down the list here, making sure everything's safe. Okay, so... Here we go. So instructions, admit guests as soon as they arrive at the box office. Once they are inside, serve them their orders at the snack bar. Switch between Nika and the snack bar and Ben at the box office by interacting with the small service bell. That's pretty cool. Oh, this is pretty freaking cool. Obviously, there's not going to be anybody here. Oh, hi. I was going to say, why is she dressed like that? But I just remember that it's Halloween. Hello, can I get a ticket, please? Sure thing. One moment. Oh, I had no idea this game had this sort of service. That's pretty cool. Okay, we'll go ahead and ring up. Go back over here. Let's see how we can help this beautiful young lady today. So we've got, uh, hello, I'd like some snacks, please. Uh, okay, what, what, hold on. I'm assuming a hot dog. I need a hot dog bun. Where are the hot dog buns? Here are the buns. All right, perfect. Starting to make sense. And now I need a drink. 
We're gonna need a cup. And what drink is it? Ginger ale soda. I'm so freaking nervous. Okay, thank you. All right, so it's not even timed, so I don't, I don't have to worry. Can I turn off the music? Actually, you know what? I'm gonna leave the music on. Fuck it. Back over here. So I was trying to get like the certain drinks and foods and stuff. And don't mind this guy. We've got Scorpion coming up here. But it wasn't updating. Like I was clicking and it just wasn't putting it on. Never mind. It's actually Scorpion. <laughs> Oh god, hold on. Wrong wrong thing. Here. <laughs> That's freaking awesome. That's a classic right there. The ass on that guy. My goodness. Alright, so he's not as needy as the last chick. So we need some rainbow candle pretzel. I know how to do a pretzel already, so we're gonna go with this. Boom boom. Bada boom, perfect. This is, see, it wasn't doing that earlier. Uh, rainbow can, ginger ale soda. Sweet. See, now it's, it's not placing it. There we go. And the rainbow candy. Rainbow candy. Oh, here it is. There you go, sir. Oh. What is that? Okay. You have a good night, too. Freaking clown. That was fucking weird. Yeah, that is fucking weird. Wait, why can I not? Huh? Right, that music is really freaking loud. I'm gonna stay put here. Oh. There's someone coming. Here he comes. <laughs> oh, goodness. It's like nobody comes in pairs either. Hello, can I get a ticket, please? Here you go. Thank you very much. Enjoy the show. All right, nobody here. Let's kind of transfer ourselves back here. What do you want, sir? Welcome to Good Burger, home of the Good Burger. Ah, oh, man, take your order. Chocolate covered peanuts, vanilla ice cream, and real nuts bar. Real nuts. You want these nuts? Here you go, sir. Um, wait. Perfect. And the real, excuse me, vanilla ice cream. Where is the ice cream? Right over here. Perfect. I need to discard something. Oh, sh Oh, my God. What? I had all that on my inventory. <laughs> okay. I didn't even know we had an inventory. Sheesh. All right, let's go back. All right, Ben's got an inventory as well. Just kind of neat. Maybe it'll be put to use in the full game. I don't know. I suppose we'll grab a bat at some point and try to kill this crazy fuck. <clears throat> it's a Teletubby. Is that a Teletubby? Gummy bear or is it Barney? I don't know. Definitely got Barney colors. Hello. Can I get a ticket, please? I mean, this guy's got the slackest job in the world. I mean... 
here we go. Let's see what she wants. All right, so she wants cheesy chips, gummy bears, cola soda, and Nas chocolate bar. All right, so we got a Nas chocolate bar. Gummy bear, okay. Perfect. And then she wants cola soda. Cola, cola. I have a feeling that music is there to distract us, so I've, I've got to be very mindful. All right. Put the damn soda down. And then we've got the Nas chocolate bar. No, we've got the cheesy chips. Excuse me. Cheesy chips. Here we go. All right. Perfect. Enjoy the show. Oh, what the fuck? Uh, s sir? Excuse me, sir. I I'm not stupid. I clearly saw you behind the sign. You can come out now. If you want to take it, it's only five bucks. All right, just give me a sec. We've got a luchador coming up. All right, let's give her a ticket. Is that a luch that's not a luchador. That's like a kitty cat or something. I don't know. Here, take your ticket. Leave. Hurry up. Somebody's watching me, and I'm going to die. I have a feeling once we transfer over and come back here, this guy's going to be inside my booth. Little does he know I can see him from back here. All right, hold on. Nothing here yet. Perfect. So, Nas Chocolate Bar. We're starting to get the hang of this. Boom. Boom. So when you get an item, you don't put it on top of the item. You put it here on the basket and it it'll just allocate it to wherever it needs to go. That's what I was doing wrong. And a real nuts bar. So instead of going here, no, you just boom. And it, that's what was giving me an issue. And tortilla chips. All right. See you later. Enjoy the show. Bro, this dude's going to be in here. I swear. Like. Is that Jason? <laughs> no, that's not Jason. All right, move it along now. Get out of here, little kid. Scram, squirt. Actually pretty paranoid right now. Let's go back here. All right, so current objective. Get the order of gummy bears, popcorn, and plain hot dog. I think I've got a hot dog. No, I don't have any of that. So, gummy bears. Gummies right here. Plain hot dog. I can actually get a hot dog. I've got a basket. Oh, no, I need a bun. There it is. It was a plain hot dog. Popcorn and gummy bears and ice cream. Let's grab some ice cream. What ice cream is it? Is it vanilla? Yes, it is. Grab the cup. Mm, that actually looks pretty fucking good. And then we've got some popcorn. Grab a bucket. Grab the popcorn. Bada bing, bada boom. Thank you. Enjoy the show. <gasps> what? I swear I just changed the bulb on this lamp a few days ago. Better check the light switch. Uh, there we go. Good. Okay. Oh, what the? F Where'd this come from? I know this is just a demo, but I feel like the full game might be pretty damn interesting. That's actually ah! Shit, man, you scared the hell out of me. That's a cool costume. Do you want a ticket? 
Well, you don't say much. Anyway, it's seven dollars for a ticket. funny but if you want to see the movie you need cash man yo this dude that does Ben's voice is so enthusiastic like could you have not laughed any better ha ha <laughs> like come on bro perhaps that's his character I don't know I'm, I'm, I'm watching a dude make balloons right in front of me right now so the hell do I know? What the fuck is that? Take your shit and kick rocks, weirdo, before I call the cops. Right, is he gone? Uh, now I need to clean up this mess. What the hell even is this? Hopefully, it's just a fake Halloween prop. What a freak. Damn it! There's gotta be some fucking booze or money around here somewhere! Wait, we're playing as the hobo? What the fuck? Oh my god. Wow, this is so out of left field. I had no I didn't even for a second think that was gonna be a thing. Alright, so if I were this guy, where would I look for money? Definitely in the fountain. No. Oh, that means that this clown's gonna be here. That fucking clown is taking Halloween a little bit too serious for my taste. Okay, this is a dead end or what? Oh! Wow. Okay, I didn't see that. So, is this locked now? Oh, they opened it. <gasps> Hold on, before we do that, what's over here? Okay, it's a little quiet. I don't like this. Wait, that's... That's the dude's truck. It must be my lucky day. <laughs> hey, wait now. Oh. Oh. So you're going to have to probably be survive. Oh, what? Man, that hobo better not be digging through the dumpster out back again. I should make sure the gate all back is locked. I, th I think it's a little too late for that, bro. <laughs> this is actually really cool that you play with all these characters. I wonder if you get to play with Phil, which was the boss, right? I want to say that. Huh. Is there a way to make these guys survive or what? Is that blood? It's leading to the park. Oh man, I hope the hobo didn't kill himself. I better take a look around. This guy's setting us up, bro. Seems like the clown didn't have any money. So, he's trying to kill his way into the theater. Interesting. Oh, jeez. That's a lot of blood. What the hell happened? I better keep looking. Oh my god. Bro, he's he skinned him and beheaded him. Trigger tree. That's fucking gross, man. What the fuck? I need to get inside now. Oh, we're dead, bro. I'm sorry. <laughs> this is actually a really cool concept for a game. Different perspectives from different characters. I, th I think I like that. I think I like that very much. Should I go check his, uh... 
Wait, let's go check the truck. This is probably a bad idea. What? This old ice cream truck is... What's it doing here? Okay, we didn't get killed, so that's good. Go ahead and close that up. Uh-huh. Oh. Yo, this dude's a savage! What the fuck? Oh my god! Wow! He is relentless! We're down to three people. The main character that we started with, uh, the dude at the front, and then of course the boss. Man, that was actually really, really neat. I wasn't expecting all that. I wasn't expecting the whole fluctuation between characters, at least not that much. That was pretty cool. All right, so we'll end it here. Um, I think this game definitely has some potential. Obviously, depending on where the story goes and how it, you know, evolves. Um, could be either really good or just a disaster. But uh, possibly, we'll see how this video does. If you guys think we should do the full walkthrough once the game is officially out, let me know down below. Thank you for hanging out, watching. Hope you enjoyed. And uh, I'll catch you guys later.